In this video, we're gonna talk about Sam and Twitch case files, murder in the shadows. Alrighty then, this is a comic book review of Sam and Twitch case files, issue number one, brought to you by Rated Comics. Let's get to it. Now for those that may or may not know anything about Sam and Twitch, Sam and Twitch is an odd couple pairing with this greedy world of Spawn. Their contrasting personalities and approaches to detective work create compelling tension and often humorous fiction in this storytelling, alright? So as we admire the art and this eerie way of painting a picture of what's going on here, there's not a lot of caption here, so I'll break down who Sam is and who Twitch is very quickly. Sam is the brawn of the duel. He's large, physically imposing with a gruff demeanor, and he's very quick tempered. Sam relies on old-fashioned police work to get things done. Twitch, on the other hand, is the brains of the operation. He's smaller and less physically intimidating, but a brilliant detective with great attention to detail. He doesn't miss anything. He's analytical and often relies on forensics. So their differences are a constant source of conflict. Sam's impulsiveness clashes with Twitch's meticulous nature, yet they have an underlying respect for one another and their contrasting skills make them a formidable detective team. So this dynamic allows them to tackle cases from diverse angles, appealing to people for both classic detective stories and the darker supernatural elements of Spawn's universe. So now that we established that this guy, whatever he's running from, he goes into this abandoned house and as he's huffing and puffing from all that running, this guy just tells him, did you follow the plan? Yeah, of course I did, bruh. Then why are you running? Well, he meets his fate and gets that bullet right there. So as the bullet dramatically falls down, this guy picks it up and we're just left with whatever the heck we're left with, all right? So we see these two guys in this pound just talking about Mario Kart, how this guy in the red cap is just going to work on the people in Princess Peach and whooping Toad and, you know, he's doing all that. So we see this ring, pay attention to that ring because that ring is going to come important later. So they go into this deli or pizza shop or whatever the case may be. I think it's a little bit of both because you got pizza and deli in the works right here. So this guy is like, man, nobody wants to mess with my Mario Kart skills. Well, you got somebody who wants to see you, man. Tell that bro to go F himself. Remember that ring? Well, that ring puts his head on the table. So remember that big physically imposing brute gold ring? Yeah, that's Sam right there. And Sam tells Diego's friend, the one, the green hat, yo, if you want some of the smoke, you better leave. Otherwise, Diego and I are going to have a private chat. But if you don't want another smoke, you better get up out of here. So the guy in the green hat leaves and Diego's like, man, you broke my nose. I don't care. Cry me a river. Here's the thing, Diego and Sam is pissed. We had a meeting this morning. Remember, you were going to point out some of those scumbags I've been hunting for but that didn't happen did it you know you broke my nose all right here clean yourself up no sense of messing up the joint like you care right because I don't care I think this guy is like Sam's mole on a case that he's working on or something that's the vibe I'm getting here and Diego's like look man I'm tired of being your little bitch whenever you call I got a life too that's not how it works all right screw all that so now the establishment the owner of the business goes up to Sam's like you know I know you're NYPD but this is a decent establishment but Sam's like yo this is police business don't don't, don't be trying me too all right you don't want this smoke and this lady he goes up to Sam's like, you need water, here's some water. And Sam tells Diego, you know how long I've been working on this Pagliano case? It don't matter. I busted my butt trying to dent this operation and keep your little butt away from him, all right? I promise your mother I do that much. And I'm starting to regret it. And Diego's like, man, just shut your stuff up, all right? And Sam's like, okay, you can tell me to shut up, all right? But you're just too stupid to know what I'm doing for you. So if you want to throw your life away, be my guest. But you don't get to mess up my life, all right? So Diego's like, yeah, but your life's already screwed up. So why are you testing me like that why you why you sweat me all right and sam's like look my life might be screwed up but my cases aren't you're not gonna put my cases in jeopardy next time you do what you did and not show it to one of my cases when i need you to point out some scumbags i'm gonna break your arms <laughs> and so that's the end of that so sam goes and gets his face shaven and in the middle of that somebody opens the door and the barber's like "Ooh, okay i'll get out the way so a mysterious hand goes up and gives sam a little nip sam was like bernie that's his barber watch it will you and Twitch is like, ha ha, heard what happened today. The chief of police wants to see us. Twitch ain't having it. And usually Twitch has Sam's back in previous comics. And whenever Sam gets into some bull jive, Twitch has his back. So Sam, usually knowing that this is the pattern just repeating itself, Sam tells Twitch, don't worry about it. This will all blow over. I barely touched the kid. That little freak father complaint? Oh no, he didn't, says Twitch. His mama did. Sam, seriously, yo, this is too much, man. This ain't funny no more. Just get in the car. I'll take care of this. And you can tell the seriousness of this extreme when Sam looks at Twitch like, yo, you really giving me the silent treatment? 
it's been 20 minutes. You can't do that to me. So in the chief's office, the chief's just grilling them apart. Like, I don't understand why we got to do this over and over again. Burke, I warned you in the past. Don't know why you can't get this through your thick head. And then Twitch tries to cover it up once again. Like, yo, I know I went sideways. Sideways, says the chief. Don't hand me that crap. Not today. Let me guess, Twitch. You weren't even there to get your partner out of harm's way. You let your partner off the leash. Isn't that right, Sam? <laughs> Sam was like not even giving a damn like yo man I'm just doing my job man that's a bull jive that's not how things are done around here you want to crack some heads be my guest I know how that works but not when it's the good guy that kid was on your side confirmation that that kid was a mole for Sam or something like that and the chief of police is like and now that the mother filed a complaint she's up my butt and I'm up your butts too and Twitch is like look message received we'll be on our way out what nah 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 Twitch, you're cool, but Sam, am I boring you? You can tell Sam is not giving a damn about all this altercation, all this confrontation, all this that is happening. It's just the same old thing to him. Twitch is over it, but for some reason, Sam is just on a whole nother level, man. <laughs> <laughs> Chief was like, if I'm boring you, man, get the hell out of my office. You're suspended for a month. I don't want to see you anywhere near this place. You got that? And do yourself a favor and go get some help. And Twitch is like, damn, a month? That's kind of harsh. Sit down, Twitch. We're not finished. You're suspended too. What? <laughs> Twitch is like, a WTF? And for what? Because he's your partner and you keep covering for him. It's why he's got such bad habits. Because you keep telling him it's okay. But it's not. You both need to get that message. So you're taking the case away from us, says Twitch, already. It's transferred. So go home, Twitch. Tell your wife the good news. Then decide if you want to be a good detective or a babysitter. I'll see you in a month. So Twitch walks through this pandemonium called NYPD with all that's happening. He goes into Sam's office. Maybe his office, too. I don't see his desk around there, but I think it's there. So Sam, expecting the usual, tells Twitch, did you calm him down? No, Sam, I didn't. In fact, he suspended me, too. Well, screw him, says Sam. Screw all of them. Let's pack up and grab a beer. No, says Twitch. What do you mean? No, what do you mean by that? I can't do this anymore. We've talked about this too many times, but you keep doing the same things over and over again, regardless of who it affects. Do you even care on any level, says Twitch? Come on now, says Sam. Give me a break. Why are you busting my balls? I don't need this crap, all right? Especially from you. Where's my keys? And Twitch being the one that's attentive to details, like, why are you panicking over there, Sam? Your keys are in your pocket. Just look. And Sam is like, <laughs> okay, well, that's cool. Twitch is like, hey, where are you going? And Sam's like, man, screw you. I'm out this bitch. So Twitch's phone rings he hangs it up and the voicemail is left and as we see we get this panel right here of all the case files and sam and twitch are about to get a new case but the voice message reads hello max that's twitch's name maximilius twitch this is jim trestle from our police academy days anyway i've been meaning to contact you and catch up with you because i've got a situation with and i'm dealing with and i know this is a long shot but i could use a fresh pair of eyes on a case that i'm working in and you're the only one i could think of that's smart enough to help me out maybe even figure it out so if you got a minute give me a call i like to run something by you because whatever this case is like i said they are very good detectors and they get there man but it's a mix of detective stories with the darker and the darker supernatural elements of spawns universe and that is the end of sam and twitch case files issue number one murder in the shadows yo man this is a heck of a way to introduce issue number one i'm in i don't know about you guys but i'm in if this is an ongoing series which i believe it is well then by all means keep tuning in for sam and twitch and some spawn content not to mention gunslinger spawn and the scourge too link in description if you wish to add any of our comic books and or any of our other rated comics limited print rated comic exclusives to add to your comic book collection support the art support the industry lastly this video is sponsored by coffee so if you'd like to buy a boy a cup of coffee link in description or donate to the super thanks but the greatest compliment you guys can do is by liking this video and subscribing to rated comics youtube channel thank you again for watching until next time